Kathy Anderson was a 19-year-old college sophomore traveling through Central America when she inadvertently witnessed the historic day when El Salvador plunged into a two-decade-long civil war where citizens were routinely tortured by death squads. Those images of seeing people with fear in their eyes and, you know, will forever stay with me. She is in El Salvador and just having a good time. And then, well, then, the, then there's a, this coup and she's thinking about what's going on and how these people are so helpless. And who in a 19-year-old ever thinks about that? Many of us would turn away from unimaginable horror. But those images empowered Kathy to co-found Survivors of Torture International. Survivors of Torture International is a nonprofit organization based right here in San Diego to help the 35,000 plus torture survivors that we have living here in our midst. Torture is very common in the world. It's practiced in many more than 100 countries at this point. Over the past 19 years, under Kathy's leadership, Survivors of Torture has helped and healed more than 1,900 men, women, and children who have fled their countries. They're the ones who will stand up to their governments and write something as a journalist, or who will be a professor and speak truth to power. Those are some of the reasons why they are tortured. There's a, a cathartic process that they begin to go through as they heal being with other torture survivors, as well as with doctors and therapists and others who can provide that specialized care and treatment for them. The agency provides a wide variety of services for torture survivors, including medical, dental, and psychological care. I've had many experiences of clients breaking down and weeping uh, men and women both about the horrible traumas they've experienced and many of them expressing a, a lot of gratitude for what the organization here was trying to do for them. When they walk through the doors here and they finally find a place where they're understood and they're believed, there's this sense of relief like, yes, someone understands me, someone knows what this is like. These wounded souls begin their path to healing here, gaining new strength and hope. They go on and they get scholarships to go to universities, they start their own businesses. She's not only saving lives, but she's giving them a new life in this country. She's a real hero because she's done a wonderful job of helping the wounded, the tortured, who are survivors and made them feeling happy. Kathy considers these survivors of torture the real heroes. They're the heroes of not just San Diego, not just our country, but really of the world. 